What's up everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be yet again another Zara haul. So if you're loving these hauls, make sure you like this video and subscribe to my channel and we're gonna get right into it. So the first item is this jumpsuit. It was $70 and I will leave the size and everything linked in the description box. I wish it was a lot longer on my legs. I guess if I was wearing heels, it would be cute for you to be able to see the shoe. So it's not that bad. It does fit perfectly. I do love the detail on these sleeves. It obviously needs to be steamed, like this is a hot mess right now. It did come with this belt. Overall, very, very cute. I could not get it over my boobs. So very cute. I got it in a small. I'm going to have to exchange it for a medium. I thought this dress would just be great to wear with sneakers or I could wear with heels. Unfortunately, it does run a little small and I could feel it just pulling all in here. So definitely going to need a size up, but I still want to be able to try this bad boy. We'll start with the top. This top is so fun. I did just try to wear it with a bra. So sorry about like that situation, but you could see the bra. So unfortunately, if I keep this top, I will have to wear it without a bra. I do love and hate this very dainty string detail. I just don't feel like it's holding me in enough, but I do think that it's really cool. So you have that really, really 90s vibe. And I have it on with these pair of jeans. I got these jeans in two different washes and in two different sizes. This is the size four, the size two did not fit me. I do love this wash. I'm probably gonna try and find them without all of the distressing. It's just a lot, but they do fit perfectly. They hit me at the perfect place on my ankle. They fit me around my hips, my waist. This is the other pair of jeans. So I do love this wash. I am gonna get them in a four, but unfortunately I could not get the two up, <laughs> up over my bum. Wow. This top is everything I could want and more. It's so freaking cute. So it is this satin material. It is super light. Obviously it ruches right here. I do need to retie this. So you can make it as short and long as you want. I do love, you guys know, like I love this kind of sleeve. It's just so dainty and girly and feminine. I could wear this with leather leggings. I could wear this with a skirt. I could wear this with jeans like I have it on right here so comfortable and it's not too low cut either. I think we have another winner. I honestly didn't know what to think about this top because if you shop on Zara's app or website, it's like they tell the models be as weird as humanly possible. Like the model was like this. I took a chance and I'm glad I did, but it is a knitted crop top. If you have a smaller chest, it will fit you even better because this little detail will hang a little bit lower. Very, very cute. Again, a great piece for fall. I'm kind of over summer shopping. It's all about transition pieces and building out wardrobe with nice neutrals and basics. <sighs> I don't know why. I feel like I am four years old again, living in Texas, about to hit the rodeo. I love the way the model had this styled. So she was wearing this with the lighter wash and it looked so cute. I'm sure if it wasn't 100 degrees right now, I'd like it a little bit more. And I think I can definitely style it to make it work. I'm just not loving it with this wash of denim. Either Zara's getting smaller or I'm getting bigger because I could not get this over my freaking head. This bodysuit is so cute. I don't even know how to describe this. It's kind of like linen. It's pretty stiff though, but it has this boning in it. Square neckline, same thing on the back. Snap detail, pretty cheeky, and I can't get it on. So I'm gonna try and get this in a medium as well. I was really excited about this. I thought this was gonna be so nice. So I switched to shorts just because I don't wanna be putting jeans off and on while I'm trying to change bodysuits. So these are not from Zara, just a heads up. This bodysuit, it's really not bad. It's not, it's super cute and it definitely does have some stretch to it. It has a snap closure and it is a cheeky bottom, but I have an even better bodysuit that I'm going to show you. I have it in two colors and I just grabbed it in white as well. This, a thousand times better than the one I'm wearing. So stay tuned, that will be coming up. 
But this bodysuit isn't bad and this is your color. You can wear jeans or sweatpants. It's just, it's not their best. There's way better. I truly don't know what the hell is going on because none of these bodysuits are going over my chest. This is another one I was super excited about. It's this black lace bodysuit. The chest is covered, but the rest is a sheer lace. This would look amazing with leather leggings, jeans, shorts. You could wear it with a blazer. I'm very, very, very disappointed I couldn't get this one on. So I will be reordering this in a medium. What is going on? But this is another bodysuit that I own in white and tan in a small and they fit perfectly. And this one I can't get on. Like I didn't get another boob job. What is happening, Zara? Holy crap, it's a miracle. A bodysuit actually fits me. So I'm very, very impressed by this one. I almost didn't get it and I'm so glad I did. I love this color in the fall. This will be great under a cardigan or a denim jacket, which I will show you in a second. But here is the square neckline. It is very form fitting, which I love. It doesn't have a snap closure, which is probably why these bodysuits have been fitting me and the other ones don't. Huge fan, I think it came in black as well, so. I'll probably pick that one up and it is a ribbed material. Hi, Cal. <laughs> I definitely think Zara is playing around with their size. So this denim jacket, I really wanted to get because I have a super oversized one from them, except it's lined inside. So not summer friendly, definitely more of like a cold weather denim jacket. And I got this in a medium and I think it fits me like a small. I got a medium because I wanted to be able to wear sweaters under it and sweatshirts under it in the fall. And I definitely can, but it's not, I don't know. I feel like this is how a small should have arrived. I do have a couple denim jackets, but they're all different washes. And I have been wearing a lot of light denim. This would look really cute with a white bodysuit, white jeans, I mean, you guys know you can wear a denim jacket with anything. So behold the most perfect bodysuit ever. This is the one that I was saying earlier that you just can't go wrong. It doesn't have a snap closure. It is a cheeky bottom. I also picked it up from a previous order in these two colors and I'm going to be getting black as well. So I did buy both of these in extra small small. This is also an extra small small, but ever since I washed the other two, they're definitely a lot tighter and I like them. Like this fit is perfect, but as soon as you wash them, they do get a little bit tighter. But this is hands down the best basic bodysuit I have ever owned. So I grabbed this little rib top and I don't exactly know how I'm gonna style it yet. I love seeing girls that wear them like this, but most of those girls have a small chest and that would not fly on me. So I can definitely see myself wearing this over one of my basic like bodycon dresses that I just have in every single color. It's an easy piece to tie around your waist or if you are going out for the day and you want something to be able to throw on at night, this is also a great piece. I think it did come in a couple other colors so I will probably pick those up. The sleeve length is great as well, but it is ribbed. So not as ribbed as this, a little finer but I can see this shrinking, so just be careful shopping and washing because this will definitely shrink. This dress might look familiar. It is from Zara. I picked it up for my Chicago trip, but unfortunately I was never able to find a belt in time. But now that I have the belt from that jumpsuit in the beginning, I'm definitely going to keep it. It's hard to do with one hand, but you just have to imagine it cinched and then, oh, I could even wear like these little Gucci heels with it. Okay, so. I don't know guys, I don't know. I just feel like this neckline isn't flattering if you have a bigger chest because you can see it's pulling right here. It's just not falling naturally. So I think it's already like struggling there. Even the design on it, I feel like it should just hang effortlessly. And if anything, it's accentuating my hip dips, which are fine, they are extremely normal. But in a dress like this, I just, I've worn better slip dresses and it's a shame because I do love this button detail and I feel like I could get it taken in a little bit over here so that you could see more of my shape, but 
It's, I just don't think it's worth it for the price tag, at least not on my body. But it is so sexy. The quality, the material is amazing. Just overall design of it is just really, really falling short. And I feel like Zara could have done a lot better. I would never wear this together. I just want to show you it quickly. What are you doing? What, like, what is this? The shoulder pads are over the top big. It is huge. This could be a dress if I wanted to wear it with a belt around it. Just everything about this is huge. I did get it with the matching shorts. I'll insert a photo over here. And they're amazing, so I'm keeping those. But what is this? Like, even if I had on a bralette in those shorts, it it's not it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and follow me on Instagram at Erin Heartbreak and I'll see you in the next video.